I think it has been a phenomenal success story of collaboration and scientific achievement. In the last four months, over a billion doses of COVID vaccines have been given, and that's within 16 months of identifying this novel virus. COVID-19 has hit Latin America and the Caribbean like no other area in the world. The region accounts for about 8% of the world's population, but almost 30% of all COVID-19 deaths. India's giant second wave has been quite a tsunami. A tsunami with a difference. Because tsunami hits, leaves carnage behind, and leaves. This one is causing a humanitarian crisis of epic proportions. We have a preparedness for crisis in Norway, no matter which party is in government. To have low-income countries who can't even vaccinate their healthcare workers, I mean, that's the system people are going into to take care of one another. You have to get the entire health system populated and the elderly uh, vaccinated as well. One in three medicines consumed in the US comes from an Indian generic manufacturer. So we can expect supply chain challenges and issues beyond COVID. If a business doesn't get every policy right about how it assesses merit so that workers from home and workers in the office are treated in a fair fashion, I think we're gonna be baking gender inequality into this new world of work. At the beginning of the pandemic, we have just seen a couple of months before of the birth of the Green Deal in Europe. And I was not sure whether it would survive the next month. And I'm very lucky that we did. Over all the prospects for the global economy have improved considerably, but the outlook is indeed brightening. Trust and technology go hand in hand and they have to be delivered together. It's not an or. I don't view it anymore as pushing digital adoption. I view it as accelerating digital demand. COVID-19 is a health crisis that has had a huge global economic impact. And I would like to think as a practitioner that banks can be part of the solution. I think the tourism industry has learned a lot from last year and we will open up in a safe and protected manner, but we will still make you know, the full Greek experience.